Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's LT. It's Missy here coming at you for the first time in a while, uh, going over L7. And uh, I just want to go over some important um, information, updates, what's going on with the project, so that way you can stay updated. Or, um, you know, if you're not able to attend these Zoom meetings and everything like that, I'll do my best to just do a general breakdown of what's going on. But before I do so, you should have taken the time out to read the disclaimer that was at the beginning of this video to understand what's going on in this channel. So with that said, let's get into this video. Now, uh, first things first, I want to go over, let's go to the earn tab here and uh, get signed in real quick. Give me a moment, there we go. So we got some new forms, okay? Um, and you see right here, you got L LSD, USDT, and this right here has a one in parentheses. Um, so I'm assuming that this form is uh, is full. That's what I'm assuming. Because they got another one right here that says number two. So I, uh, so you can see that the buttons are not here anymore for you to stake, um, you know, to earn this form anymore because I'm assuming that that's the reason why it's full. So they got a new one here for you to go to and you can start earning with this form uh, producing the same um, currency um, outcomes, LSD. All right. And uh, the yield is still 0.5% daily as well. Um, so let's say let's say it's maximum daily 0 0.5 uh, as we should know by now these yields can fluctuate depending on how many people join into these forms it's just like any other form on, a, on any other decentralized exchange uh, to where you get a lot of people that join uh, the, the, the more people that join the lower that you'll be able to earn per day uh, so you can see that on pancake swap most definitely there as well when something launches brand new It'd be like, oh, 10,000 APY, APY, something like that. And then as everyone starts to join it, then it goes down to like 100% APY or 50% APY and it keeps on dropping. You know, so I'm not saying that that's the same thing that's happening here to that kind of um, rate of a drop, but it will fluctuate uh, every now and then. All right. So other thing as well, why is my wallet not showing up here? Let me connect the wallet. There we go. Okay, so now you see this right here is also looks like it's no longer available. Uh, so you want to take a, you know, just notice all these these forms that's not available right now. And it, it's, it makes sense, especially with Ordi not to be available since the issues with Trust Wallet um, and I think SafePal are there because MetaMask does not have a Bitcoin wallet. So you cannot earn Ordi. APX, I don't know why that's right there is not available, but... Maybe they'll do update in the future to explain to why APX is not available. Ordi most definitely is, is in the Bitcoin uh, Bitcoin network. They understand that. And everyone's having to import their wallets from, from Trust Wallet SafePal over to MetaMask. Um, you know, so you can just simply go to MetaMask, use your, uh, your, your security. Uh, give me a moment. Sorry about that. The kids are playing, so just had to remind them I'm doing a video and try to keep as quiet as possible. Um, but anyways, you know, so... Trust Wallet, SafePal are no, no longer um, like accessing the, the, the forms or anything like that anymore. So what L7 is asking for you to do is go to like MetaMask, you create a MetaMask uh, wallet. And, um, you know, so what you do is you just use your keys, you know, from the, um, you know, so you, that says add account or hardware wallet. You click on that button, then you put in your security keys to import your wallet into MetaMask. And then you'll be able to continue to uh, see everything that way, okay? Um, so another thing, coming down further, you will see that we got new forms that are available as well. I don't know why the photos are not, uh, images not showing up, showing up just fine on the phone. But you can earn with um, Bitcoin with Peace USDT pair. Uh, you can earn Ethereum with Peace USDT pair. You can also earn BNB with uh, Peace USDT pair. And then you can also earn Solana with Peace USDT pair. Then, you know, you continue on, you got LSD, USDT to earn Ethereum, LSD, USDT to earn Solana, LSD, USDT to earn BNB, then you got RTC, USDT, uh, USDT to earn BTC, and you see RTC, USDT to earn Ethereum, RTC, USDT to earn BNB, RTC, USDT to earn Solana, and that right there uh, completes the new list of forms that are here now uh, for us to be able to use. So the, the seven pool has, um, you know, they changed the name from sugar pool to seven pool. And, you know, so we got the addition of ERT7. Um, uh, they're, they're working on a prom. Um, I'm adding loser chick um, here pretty soon to a form and possibly a pool as well. So that way we can earn some more loser chick tokens going forward. Um, so now the other thing is you go to the announcement section and you'll be able to see. Uh, oh, there, there's another announcement that, that was just added here. Okay. 
So you got LSD, you got the uh, the burn that happened. So I'm not gonna go to the um, you know the links right here to show you the burn information or anything like that. You can do that on your own. But they just completed the six burn of um LSD and RTC. So that you know people was asking about why it wasn't uh, a burn that was um, from from process back on the 27th. They did it today. All right, and you go check that information out for yourself. Now let's go back. Let's check out this new announcement right here that just came out. So yeah, just talked about the new forms. Um, and th this announcement was not there. Literally, I shared this information in my Telegram and Facebook communities already, well before they came out with the announcement. And so they just came out with the announcement now with all of the new forms right now. All right. So uh, you go over this announcement yourself, and you can see how much you better earn and everything like that, or three times all this other type of stuff, right? And uh, so they give you the contract address for each of the uh, the, the cryptos because these are cryptocurrencies: Ethereum, BNB, uh, Bitcoin, Solana. Those are cryptocurrencies. So uh, you know they got the, the Solana on the Belt 20 network, and you can just copy this address. For example, I'm gonna show you right quick. So just copy that, and then I'm gonna go into my wallet, and we're gonna go down to the bottom, and it says import tokens, and then we we'll go to custom token. Paste the contract address right here and just click on next and then import. Just that simple. And you know, so you can see it again. Let's go with, I already got BNB up in there. Let's go with Ethereum. They got Ethereum on the Belt 20 address as well. And let's go back over to my MetaMask wallet. You can do this on your mobile app as well. It's the same way. All right. And let's see, import tokens. Go to custom token. Paste that in there. And you know, while I'm here, I may as well just add in the last one. I don't think I have, uh, let's see, Ethereum. I got Bitcoin already added. I already have BNB. So it was just Solana and Ethereum I had to add. Okay, so I'm good to go. All right, but anyways, they got this new announcement right here uh, now available for everyone to use uh, or to read over. So um, I'll be sharing this. I'm actually share this inside of my group right now. Actually, I'm gonna, pay, I'm gonna copy it, but then I'm gonna go to another important um, update that you need to be um, like, informed on so right here as we know discord and on the the, the twitter account or platform etc whatever you want to call the thing i call it twitter still um it's rampant with people that's able to post um uh, scam links so you want to make sure that you're paying attention to the links that's being shared and that is one of these links right here that you are able to access okay because if you click on the wrong link you can end up getting your wallet hacked, okay? Get your wallet compromised. And then they'll be able to drain your wallet of everything. So be careful with those announcements. If those announcements are not shown here inside the Telegram official channel, then you need to make sure you pay extra uh, attention to those announcements that are being shared, okay? Because you don't want to click on the wrong link, all right? So this information is being shared constantly inside of the uh, Telegram uh, community channel on here, all right? And you know, so now let me go over here to my group and let me go down here and let me paste this and let me go ahead and pin it as well. And I do the same thing in my, my Facebook group later. But anyways, moving on. So at the end of the Zoom today, we actually got a you know another update and it's about us following debt screener now. AVE.AI is having some issues and it's a good thing that they updated us now because like the thing that everybody's been wondering about is liquidity, right? It's like, why is the liquidity still over 23 million? And you know, it just didn't make sense to me either. When, especially when you're getting all these partnerships, you got the IDOs and everything like that being launched. And we're still sitting over $23 million in liquidity. It didn't make any sense. Well, here on Debt Screener, they just launched LSD on Debt Screener today, as you can see, uh, at 7 a.m. my time. Um, and you can see the liquidity for LSD is actually $86.3 million. This right here is a huge, um, you know, plus because as we know, um, they told us a while back that once liquidity gets to $100 million, we'll be able to have more access to like uh, our LUSD and LSD, right? We might not have access to the LUSD. We'll probably have to convert uh, LUSD over to LSD and then we'll be able to be able to transfer the LSD outside of the DAO. You know, to his changes or to the debit card, whatever the case may be, right? So, once we get to the hundred million dollar threshold, that's when we're supposed to have more access to the LSD transferring outside of the DAP as well. So we just gotta hope to see if they're gonna keep that word or not. 
um, or if they're able to do something else to, to give us more access to the LSD and the DAO. Because at that moment, they said that the liquidity should be stable enough to where they'll be able to handle the huge demand of people moving the LSD outside of the DAO. Would, would the liquidity drop a lot? Absolutely it will because, you know, when people start selling the LSD on the open market, that's going to affect the liquidity as well. Not, not that many people hold LSD tokens anymore, all right? But the thing is that this right here is big. You see it right here, $86.3 million in liquidity right there, all right? And you can see what the current price is at right now. As many people have been selling LSD and everything like that, um, you know, um, from, and, and from, from inside of that. So just to see that the price is down to over $5 right now, $5 and what, 65 cents right now, it lets you know what kind of effect it can have on the price just from the, the volume of people selling the LSD, uh, DAP LSD right now, right? Just, just imagine what could happen if we're able to transfer LSD from the DAP to the open market and sell it for USDT to cash out, you know? So just imagine what could happen at that moment. Of course, there's going to be a big dip in the price again, but once we get rid of, you know, the shaky hands of LSD, and you just got the diamond holders um, going forward after that, that's when the price is going to really go ahead and start to establish itself again and come stronger again. Now, what, what would it go down to? I have no idea. We just got to hope that by the time we get to $100 million in liquidity, we're able to see that the price of LSD is between $10 to $15 again. But will, will we see that price again? I don't know. It just depends on how many people just slows down on, on the sell rate of LSD. That's, all the, that's what it depends on, all right? So, that right there completes my update today um, on L7. Just want to do this quick update so that way you can uh, stay informed and share this video with other people as well. Um, but uh, L7 is absolutely doing great things right now. I'm, I'm happy with the project. This is one of the more, I, I say, uh, secure projects or honest projects out there in the cryptocurrency space, in my opinion. Yeah, there's other people that may think otherwise, but uh, to me, those people don't know what they're talking about, in my opinion, because when you got something like L7 that's doing what it's doing, and you calling L7 a scam, then that means pancake swap, sushi swap, um, you know, uni swap, and all these other debts are all um, scams as well. All right, but anyways, I, dig I, I digress. So I'm not going to continue on down that road, and uh, you know, and just gonna end, end it right there. So if you like what you heard in the song, please like subscribe to the channel. Also, feel free to share this video with other people. If you're interested in joining L7, I have my links down in the description of this video as well as in the comment section. If you heard L7 from someone else, please get back with that person. Use their referral link. Uh, create a, job, a passive income and show us how to do the same thing. Remember, it is all up to us, you know, to help this project go grow. If, if you're looking for income, you're making it with the NFT staking right out, you know, from the very beginning. So use your LSD and your LUSD that you're generating every single day and stake it into the form. I don't understand why, you know, I still don't understand why people don't want to do this. They want, they want to sell the LSD to exit, you know, the, 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 you know, the program altogether. Why they're still generating more LSD every single day. If you're generating more LSD and LUSD every single day, stake it here in this form. Start generating your, your own passive income. I saw someone say they was trying to sell 10,000 LSD. The, you know, a few days ago in the uh, community channel. And I'm like, if you got 10,000 or, you know, the equivalent amount uh, to the, the value of the uh, LSD that you're holding in LUSD, which would be like $50,000 or something like that, then why don't you stake it and produce over $100 per day and uh, $100 per week, you know, passively for yourself? It's that simple. Then you'd be able to repeat that every single week, every single day, or every single fit. And you'll be able to get your income up to like $500 a week, which would give you $2,000 per month passively. I don't understand why people don't, they can't see that right there. I just don't understand that at all. But anyways, that's all I have to say. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next time in this video. Take care, everyone.